What's up, everyone? Hope you're well. Toy Insanity here, and today I got them putty pots. Putty pots! So someone finally, finally decided to put little figures in Silly Putty. There's actually a bunch of these uh, little cheap toy manufacturers have a variety of putties going on. It's like a whole trend in this toy economy. But this is the only one that finally, like I said, finally someone's putting figures. I keep looking at those other ones because it's like glitter putty and uh, what's the what's the sand, the kinetic sand. They're not putting figures in them. It makes no sense. You put a figure in there, you'll sell twice as many. Guaranteed. So of all the cheap toy companies, I'm talking Jaru, Zuru, what's another one, Zing, Imperial finally made it happen. These are by Imperial. There's three on like the girly side of things and three on the boy side of things. Putty pods, collectible 10 pod, colorful putty inside, hidden figure included. Can you read that? That's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. We got Sprinkles, the Pony, Hazel the Fairy, Flora, the Mermaid. And we also got Torch, the Tiki, Bones, the Dino, and Zork. The alien. I'm trying to think of the alien from Rick and Morty that he looks kind of like. Man, let's get into it. Some of these packages are just falling apart. Super cheap. Imperial. Don't forget to stretch, mold, and bounce. Ten pod. Ten pod. Putty pods, guys. Ten pod. Come on. Come on, lady. What's her name? Flora. Flora seems more like the fairy's name. All right, got it. Ah. Okay, Flora. I don't really like this one because it can't stand up. All you would have had to do is make her sitting down with her tail kind of going behind her. You can't display this one upright. <laughs> I think I kind of liked it. They didn't just put it in the slime. By the way, this is slime. This is not putty. Yeah, that is slime. These are slime pods. What? I thought they're gonna be silly putty. Everyone knows the consistency of silly putty. That is slime. All right, let's check out Hazel. Oh, Jimmy Hazel. Hazel in green. The figure is also purple, unexpected. I thought for sure this monoplastic figure would be a different color. Also, this one can't stand up either. Green slime. Yo, I still can't believe these are called putty pots. What's the horse's name? Eloise Sprinkles. I like Eloise better. Come on. <sighs> All right. What? It's a different color. This makes me think there's multiple colors to collect each one in. And this one, this one will stand up. I still don't like it though because they put the mold line right down its face. Who does that? Purple slime. All right, let's get into the really good ones. Zork. Zork. I am Zork from Zorkulon. Do you want to see my Zorkutron? All right. What? 
a really interesting color. Huh. So Zork has purple in the boys' side of things. The dino is bones. It's green, it gets the same color as the pony. Also surprising, I thought they were going to do more earth tones or something for the boys' side. Pastels for girls, earth tones for boys. And the last one, I think his name is Torch. Come on. Woo! Bright orange figure. I like that. This dude's got character. This is one of my favorite mono figures in any monochromatic toy line. Look at this guy. I like him a lot. Ah, I want to pursue that one in multiple colors. Right? Let's see. Let's see all everything. Purple fairy can't stand up. Purple mermaid can't stand up. Uh, like a aqua blue pony, which can stand up. Aqua Blue Dino. Super weird. I thought this would be like green, bright green, dark green. The brown Alien. Very weird color. And really bright Tiki. Look how that sculpt, not just the color, but the sculpt stands out. I mean, it's taller, it's got great proportions. So it seems pretty obvious, though I guess I can't say this with 100% certainty, but my belief is if you find these elsewhere, like I could, pursue, I could pursue another set at another Walmart and get the same figures in different colors. Also if you guys buy them, let me know what colors you end up with. Uh, is it the case that you would get these ones in the brown and orange? Seems kind of unlikely. But I would I also think that there's probably more colors than just this. Anyway, I'm Toy Insanity. I hope you enjoyed the putty pods. Yo, hit up that guy at littleweirdos.com because he loves monochromatic figures. And he would definitely like the boys ones, if not all of them. Yo, hashtag littleweirdos.com. Or hashtag littleweirdos. I'll put the hashtag on there and see if we can connect. These are pretty cool. This is, like I said, by far the standout. Guys, I'm Toy Insanity. Go ahead and smash that like button. And I'll see you on the flippity flop.